What's up, everybody? My name is Eric Bland. That is right. We're out in Detroit Sponge. What's up, man? Look who I found going? here. What's up? Talk to us. What, co what company are you from? Uh, my name is Curtis Lane, and I'm the owner of Diamond Shine Window Cleaning. All yeah. right. Very cool, man. So he stopped me. He's like, hey, I seen you on Keith's video, and you were just randomly doing some business. And I, I, I said, yeah, that's me, man. So let's go ahead and do this. Let's go ahead and take a look uh, at your setup, if we could, man. So let's right. go ahead. So do you lift, too? Or yeah. You... So I, right. I did lift this past winter. It's All right. kind of slow money. but. Yeah. Yeah, that's all right. A yeah, little, just, a little bit of extra money, we're right? We're working hard. We're out here grinding. Grinding. That's right. Uh oh. Yeah, is this so, for gutter cleaning? Yeah. So uh, I have the buckets for gutter cleaning. We're all right. Kind of a minimal setup right now. I just clean, uh, cleaned out my car completely. Nice, man. Nice got setup. Got my rags. Right. Got a couple buckets. So do you call these rags or you call them towels? Uh, I call them rags, but they're huck towels. Huck whatever. towels. So, so <laughs> I'm, I'm like so huge on making sure that we never use the word rags. We just use the word towels. But all that's right. cool. Yeah. That's all right. <laughs> So, all right, so we got the little bucket, yeah. sweet, so it's so, compact, which is nice. Yeah, so I, I have a couple of these left. Right now it's a minimal setup that I'm doing, but uh, no, that's I, cool. I love this, um, the Porcupine Sleep yeah. by Ederay. It's, it's perfect, because I get a lot of windows that have those mulch spots on the little mold spots that grow yeah, let's uh, take a around look the mulch. That. All right, so now, do you use this on tinted windows? Probably not because it's no, really rough, right? right? And right, then from no. my experience, it, it really scratches the heck out of tinted windows. So if you're yeah. gonna get the porcupine, it's fantastic, but be careful if you're doing tent, keep it away, away from Yeah, that. something so. like this, like I, I use the Mormon accelerator as well, uh -oh. so. How do you like that accelerator? Uh, Did it, you finally it, get it, it down? It took a while, it took a while to uh, master it, but yeah, I'm pretty good at it. I All had right. to modify it a little bit. It has right. these end clips that- Let's take a look. As you can see right now, where is that All right. there? They're, they're pretty straight, but when you get it out of the box, these clips are bent in. So you have to boil them down and bend them out. Boil them down, bend them out. Yeah. Okay. It's kind of it's kind of weird. Let's take a look at that yeah. angle. See this angle? And then this angle coming in right here too. Let's go right here. Perfect. I like it, man. Yeah. That's sick. So it took right, some so getting used to, but it works. We have the Warner uh, yep. collapsible ladder, yep. right? Had that back in the day, man. And then how do you like the Ederay pole? Bring that Ederay oh, pole yeah. out here. That, oh, that thing is... That thing's sick. So, do you do a lot of straight pulling? Uh, so with the accelerator, I I do fan. I can fan on the pole, yep, which is super absolutely. nice. This Ederay pole is awesome. You got the Mormon. Yeah, actually, I you had got the Mormon connector. I had to get the Mormon <laughs> connector. All right. So you know the new Mormon handle? Did you see the new Mormon handle? I did. Yet? Last time I was here, I checked it out. Okay. Totally different, I think, on the inside, so it fits on any pole now. Oh, that's so I, nice. I, I believe. I, I went. I, I went through about a week without that, and just with the Ederay oh, attachment, and, and it, it just was, it was all over. And you're putting duct tape on yeah. it, and you're like trying to make sure it doesn't go anywhere. I love this setup. And then what do we have here? We have another. This is yeah, just another uh, is just, simple pole. This yeah, must be just, coming from like Lowe's or yeah, something, right? Yeah, I believe if I'm it's mistaken, from Lowe's. If I'm not mistaken, yep. So, so this one right here. This is something that you guys get started in. You know, grab this pole ahead and just have some fun with it. I'm telling you, this is great stuff. Let's see your belt setup, man. All right. So you have some yard signs, I see. Let's yeah. go ahead while he takes his stuff out. I'm gonna swing around and take a look at this magnet there. Take a look at this. This is what I'm talking about. Look how sweet this is, you guys. He has this information right on there. He's able to let him know exactly who he is, which is awesome. We do something very similar. We just have a huge billboard on the side of ours. Oh, a nice little compartment down there. Oh, hey, you got the- uh, The Mormon? The, this, is no, that, is that Mormon? This is, uh, this is not, this is, um, Oh gosh, I can't think of the name of this one, but yeah. It's the cheapest one they had in there. I was nope. just getting my You know what? One. It was pretty cool because it's got bigger chinos and you can put your thicker chinos in there, which is nice. All right, so you have on here. Yeah, so I have my, my bucket on a belt right here. It's and that's kind Ederay? Of, yeah, an Ederay one. I'm thinking of upgrading to one that has uh, multiple spots for different squeegees because right now I can just hold uh, one, one have, squeegee in have there. Have you ever seen the, um, have you ever seen the, um, Oh my gosh, what is it, you guys? Help me out here. Um, Reach It has it. Uh, I have it in there. I, I forget what you call them. Uh, now you guys are going to say, come on, Eric, <laughs> it's, it's this. Um, the Gunslinger. You yeah, the I gunslinger? have seen the Gunslinger. Dude, I, I've, I've got him. I've heard I, I, I Listen, well, I'm just telling you, highly recommend it. Okay. Go just buy one. Um, just if try for it out. something ever happened to it, He's gonna replace it. Dude, I'm just telling you, you'll have so much room everywhere. I'll show you what I have, and okay. you're gonna be like, holy crap. All right, I'm just gonna get it real quick. Take a look at this. So you were talking about having numerous spots. Yeah. Look oh, at this wow. thing. Yeah, that's, that's Okay, intense. so there's three pouches, all right? 
then you have a, a little holder here and then you have a holder on this side as well so crazy amount of room man yeah. it's it's very spacious but uh, something to think about for you so let's take a look That's at awesome. your uh Let's take a look at your belt here. So yeah, I'm just running. I just got a tool belt from Home Depot. and That's perfect. That's basics. all you need. I, I hang a rag from here. I hang a rag when I have it on. I'll rag just, or towel? A towel. towel. I'm going to get him to say towel before <laughs> the end of that. this conversation. <laughs> all right, I'll hang a towel from there. Yep. I'll, I'll hold uh, like a wet towel that I'm doing tracks with in here. Sick. Hold some steel wool in here, quad zero steel wool. Awesome. And nothing else. I have this nice pouch back here. All right, what kind so, of razor you have here? Uh, that's the Triumph, Triumph MK3. What? MK3. I love that thing. Yeah. It's so sweet. It's awesome. Good, good Super blade. Super easy to change the uh, blades on. Yeah, absolutely. Well. I like that one better than the Unger, um, mm -hmm. and I like it better than that Ettore one because it seems like it never goes straight across the glass. This yeah. one does. Yeah. And it, and it works out really, really well. What else do you got, man? Do you mind if we go in this yeah, bucket? Go for I'm it. just diving in this car, like, hey. All right, so, so this is perfect. Always need one of these bad boys yeah, for. We have, we have a few of those. That's awesome. You got a couple squeegees yeah, in here. Yeah, a couple here too. different size squeegees. As I said, I'm here. not the most organized at the moment, but That's I have. Right. You got a screw gun. What's the screw gun for? Uh, I went camping. Oh, <laughs> it was just all right. It's car. like, well, you know, when you do gutters, sometimes if they have gutter uh, oh, yeah, screens the, over the, the top, you have to go ahead and take those off. So I didn't know that was yeah. for. Let's take a look at your sign too. I think right. that's yeah, huge. Yeah. So you put these signs out. Where'd you get the signs made? Um, so I actually used to work at a recycler's supply company. So okay. I, I have a connection. I had a connection. Sh there. Show me your sign. They so it's both of, sides. Yeah, it's both sides. It just has my number on it and my my logo. Diamond Sick, dude. Plate. And you put those out, and then you collect them after you're done. Yeah. So I'll ask the the customer if I can put them out in their yard just for the time being, and then if they seem friendly and they they seem supportive of what i'm doing then i'll ask them if i can if i can keep it out there for maybe a week or so and just come by come back and yeah, come it. back and pick it up and that's i tell awesome. them if at any point they get sick of looking at it feel free to just throw it away <laughs> that's awesome yeah. where do you get your shirts done at? Uh, vista print vista print yeah that's awesome I, I what does that what does that shirt cost you this was about 34 dollars 34 dollars you guys yeah. can get one of these off vistaprint.com man it's pretty awesome it's yep. it's good material too Not it's bad. like a breathable material yeah that's they run sick. a little bit big but yeah no hey that's all you need expected. that's awesome Awesome. So, all right. So, tell me, uh, why did you get started in the window cleaning business? You told me when we were sitting in there, uh, you said yeah, I quit. You know, college. I was done. Yeah. Like, why did you start window cleaning? You know, so I I had kind of a a rougher upbringing. Like, I come from a fortunate family, but I was just kind of an idiot when I was a kid. And uh, I was I started going to college, just community college. Dabbled around in that for like five years and never even got an associate's degree always doing like stuff that I wanted to was more of a hobby as than a career like stuff that I couldn't really make money in and decided that I just kind of wanted to like grow a business and start like putting my adult foot down good for you in man. life and uh, was looking at some low low startup cost businesses to start like I, I always I, I I always wanted to be my own boss I hate working for people yes I just I can't can't stand it that's so. awesome so uh what you know what do you do uh what is your top revenue that you pulled in is this your first year in the business second year in the business so Third? this would i i've been in business technically since 2016 just okay. kind of the last two years were a side hustle while i was still side in hustle school. so this would this has by far been my best year we've been super busy like pretty consistently since uh when was it maybe like middle of march we've been doing like at least six grand a, every a month, every month which has been more money than i've made so far and that's definitely six grand you know low. some people make 12 grand in a year and they're like oh my god yeah. this is this is awesome money you now you make you know 12 grand in two months and yeah. you're like what the heck and yeah just like i need to make better. more now yeah and now you're like i'm at 10 grand you were talking about 10 grand in one yeah. month i mean some yeah. of these people out there don't get that kind of money aspect of it but you can make it and it just gets better and better and better so anything you want to say Tell them where you can get, you know, your information and then yeah, contact so, you. Yeah, so Diamond Shine Window Cleaning, uh, my number's right here. <laughs> there it is. Yeah, you can find us on Facebook at, uh, at DSWCMI, um, DiamondShineWC.com. And yeah, that's my all my socials and whatnot. So. Sweet, you guys go take, take a look at them. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys and I'll see you guys soon. See you guys. Peace.